something that's very strong in many. That's why we love a song with the message of acceptance. So get ready for our first song and showstopper, You Are My Refuge. Hopefully that song made you feel calm and brought you peace. While our last song is more of a gentle opener, our next one will have you on the edge of your seat. Cantate Domino is filled with exciting rhythms, dynamics, and harmonies. The phrase Cantate Domino is in Latin and translates to sing to the Lord. There are many other Latin phrases, including omnistera, translating to the entire world, and canticum novum, meaning new song. When learning this song, we focus on adding dynamic contrast, which is the change in volumes we sing, as well as using good diction, which is enunciating the words we are singing so you can understand us. In this song, there is a section in the middle where each voice part sings different words, notes, and rhythms. The basses start, followed by the tenors, altos, and finally the sopranos. This creates a really cool layering effect. Another exciting section includes switching time signatures numerous times. We go from 4-4 four, four, to 3-4 to 2-4 and then back to 3-4 and so on. We learn these difficult changes by speaking and clapping the rhythms. This song was the first one we learned for this concert and a favorite to many. Hopefully you enjoy this exciting song. Don't be no party. 
Chuck, we have another song. Oh yeah, right. Our next song will take you to a whole new world. Fresh off the live action Aladdin and originally sung by Naomi Scott, Speechless is a beautiful piece. All the students have absolutely fallen in love with it and its message of strength. This beautiful piece includes two soloists, Lauren Holm and Dylan O'Connor. This song inspires us all to try and to learn. Thank you all for listening to our pieces tonight and a huge thanks to Mrs. Clutter for helping us grow as young musicians. We are so excited that you all get to see our growth and progress from the last concert. All right, let's get on with our next song of the evening. We hope it leaves you speechless.
Hopefully you enjoyed that spectacular song. We had a lot of fun singing it. Before we get started with our final piece, we would like to give a huge shout out to our amazing accompanist, Mrs. Callagher. She is always so patient, kind, helpful, and she is a tremendous help letting us grow as musicians in this song. We would also like to thank Mrs. Clutter and Mrs. O'Leary for all they do for us. They always have smiles on their faces and are truly some of the most positive people we know. They are always working so hard to push us to be the best we can be. We have really enjoyed working with all three of these incredible people this year. Can we all give them a big round of applause? Our final song is a beautiful piece called Sing Gently, composed by Eric Whitaker. This song was created in April 2020 during the start of COVID-19, two years ago. It is unbelievable that it has already been around two years since all of this started. Looking back at the crazy year that we had last year, with one of our concerts being without any live audience, we are so incredibly grateful to have the opportunities to sing for all of you tonight. When this song was created, 17,572 people of all ages from 129 different countries sent in videos singing their part and they were all put together resulting in a truly breathtaking virtual performance. This is Clutter showed us this video when she first introduced this song to us and it made us feel inspired, hopeful, and encouraged for all of us to come together. Hopefully our performance makes you feel the same way. Enjoy, sing gently.
that's the portion for ninth grade choir. Um, we wanted to do something a little different with introductions today. I asked who is interested in journalism, and so we let them do um, a lot of the interviews to see what this music was about, and a lot of in-depth study, and it was just really wonderful to see what they came up with, and I thought that was pretty cool. Didn't you, tonight, with the, the MCs? So anyway, we are gonna sit the ninth grade down in the back, and it'll be chamber time, so here we go.